Alright everybody, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, today's video is going to be just a little bit of a shout out. I don't even know who I'm shouting out. In fact, I do know one person. One out of the four. So recently, I have received Amazon packages in my P.O. box with books in them with no note. Okay, so people have sent me books. I've received them. I've opened them. I haven't read the books yet but I appreciate it, I just don't know who sent them to me. So, first of all, I'm going to show you what books I've got, because they are pretty cool. The first one I received was this one. High Performance Habits, number one New York Times best-selling author, Brendan Burchard. Okay, so if you were the one that sent that to me, thank you. Let me know in the comment section below. The second one. Napoleon Hill. Outwitting the Devil. He's the author of Think and Grow Rich, the best-selling success book of all time. So it's another like success, like high performance, you know, leveling up your life kind of book. And uh, this one's called Outwitting the Devil, The Secret to Freedom and Success. So yeah, that's another one. I don't know, once again, I don't know who sent it to me. It was in his own individual package, so I'm assuming it was someone different. And the third one that I received with no note, Unfuck Yourself. And this is a book that I have actually skimmed through, and I was in a sense of disbelief when I did, because every single random page that I opened, I literally opened up like, I don't know, four or five random pages throughout the book. And as I did, as I looked through those random pages, every single paragraph, every single topic and word that I read was associated to me. It related to me. It was like I was in my own fucking head. And this book is all about getting out of your own head and into your life. Unfucking yourself. A lot of us are fucked. We're fucked because we're constantly in our own head. We can't live in the present. We're always imagining what the future is or regretting or remembering what the past was. We're never actually in the present moment. We're always worrying about something and that is me. I'm, I'm always in my own head guys. I'm never present. And so I think this book, whoever sent it to me, I want to say thank you man. Because the limited amount that I have actually read so far really, really got to me. It really affected me. It's a great book and it's exactly what I needed. I took this away with me on holiday to Bali like I said, I read through a few pages and every single word that I read was powerful to me personally. So whoever thought I needed this book, you obviously know me better than I know myself, honestly. I want to say thank you. Thank you very much for sending that. So, so these are the three books I was talking about. Each one came in an individual packet and uh, there were no notes. They came from Amazon. So I'll get through them, I want to say, but whoever did send them, I want to say thanks. A big thanks. And there was a fourth Amazon book, believe it or not. This one did come with a, a little note. If I can find it here. Here it is. And we all know what this book's about. Friday Night Lights. I believe it's based on a true story about Texas high school football back in the 80s. And um, it's a story that, you know, well, obviously it's a movie. A lot of people have said, watch the movie, don't worry about the book. I would like to read the book, try and get these characters in my head as how they look and stuff like that, and then go and watch the movie. Because if you watch the movie first and then you go and read the book, you've got those characters in your head and you can't really imagine exactly what things were looking like, who, what they looked like, what their personalities were like, what they did, you know, their nuances and stuff like that. So I can't wait to read it. It's, it's, a, it's a bit of a read, I must say. It's uh, 360. 366 pages, and it's by H.G. Bissinger, Sports Illustrated Greatest American Football Book of All Time. So my man, Charles, thank you. He said, love your work. Keep up the sincerity from Charles French Gonzalez. Thank you, my man, Mr. Gonzalez. I will, I will get onto this book. I'll definitely read it, as well as reading these three. And uh, that's, that's what this video is all about. I just wanted to shout out awesome people who've, who've thought of me, thought I needed some self-help, <laughs> and sent me these books. And you know what? They're going to look fantastic sitting up on my third shelf behind me, and that's exactly where books are going to go. 
We've got, we've got the shelf at the top for the American football helmets. We've got the shelf in the middle for the hats. And we've got the shelf at the bottom for the books. And also for what I'm going to be opening in my next video, which is super exciting. This little baby. And if you don't know what this is, tune into the next video because it's going to be a very exciting one. I want to say thank you everybody for being here. Thank you to my bookworms for sending me the books. If you want to support me, you want to support the channel, if you've liked this video, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I will see you in the next one. Peace out.